today I'm going to be showing you the funnel which I'm using for my seven figure ecom client, which currently has already got his private community to nearly $1,000 monthly recurring revenue in just 43 days. Mind you, this target was only hit with one small piece of this funnel and not the entire funnel in place. So now we're going to be working on the whole funnel and I'm going to be taking you through every single step and why you'd have that there. If you've got any, question, any questions about the funnel, feel free to leave them in the comments and I'll reply to them whenever possible. And if you like what you see, subscribe and like for more videos like this. This is just a little heads up as well. If you want me to set up a similar funnel for yourself and your business, then there's a link in the description to book a no obligation, completely free call with myself and we can have a quick 15 minute chat on how it's set up the exact same funnel for your business. Let's get into it. So the first part of every single funnel is the lead acquisition. Now, my client currently has one main stream, which is his X or Twitter, but for every single funnel, ideally you want as many streams of eyeballs as possible because this increases your chances of getting people looking into your page, which increases the chance of more people actually converting. So the three main ones we target here are YouTube, Instagram, and then X. Now they have different content reasons. For instance, your X would be a post, your written content. Instagram might be short reels that are also the same as TikTok. And then YouTube would be kind of longer format videos such as this one. Then from there, you're gonna have to bear with me because there's a lot of arrows here. I'll explain where every single one goes. Then from there, we're gonna send this traffic to either the landing page for the paid community or the opt-in for some free training or just to kind of get their details. Now they both serve their own separate purposes. The landing page is for people who perhaps want to ready to buy, just having a look. In which case, having a good landing page is another idea completely and that needs to be worked on because you can't direct all this traffic and then have a really crap landing page. Not saying you need amazing design, but you do need to have a good mix of design and copy to actually convert your audience. The second path is the opt-in to the free training. So I'm gonna go down this route for now. So once we have them actually opting in for some free training, some sort of lead magnet, where we got the email, we have the name, now we can target them. You'll also notice there's an arrow going straight from social media to the free telegram. This is kind of as a free platform as well for the leads to actually enter. You also have the free Discord as well. Again, free communities, right? Ideally, we want to get them into the free communities first and then the paid ones. Because once we've got them in through the gate, it means we can retarget them again and again to then sell them. So from the free telegram, we also have the email sequence, which is for the free training, obviously. Now, the simple framework to follow is VVSH, which is value, value, soft sell, hard sell. You have three value emails. Third one is a soft sell, perhaps a case study. And the fourth one is a hard sell, just showcasing your course. Now, you'll notice there's an arrow between the two. This is because they are interchangeable and you can actually essentially use either as a nurture sequence. But also you can put parts of the email in the free telegram. You can use stuff in the free telegram instead of the emails, etc., etc. Now, the main way we're going to be utilizing the free communities over here, we have the side and then we have the side for nurturing. The main reason we're going to use them is to post value posts, you've got voice notes, you have tips, monthly live calls, exclusive access to documents. Now, these things are going to be a lot more accessible in Telegram and Discord as opposed to on emails because you can't really have voice notes and stuff on emails. So in that case, it can be a lot better, but the rest of it you can have between all three. And then for certain people in the free Discord, you can have stuff like free every two week calls because they are already kind of mixed amongst the paid members, bonus content, exclusive lessons, networking, ask questions, certain things which are not in the Telegram just to get them more comfortable moving up to a platform. And then we have the motivational factor as well because like I said, you're alongside your peers so you can see what kind of stuff they're doing. From here, there's two ways you can go. You can either go towards the paid membership or we can go towards the mentorship. Now we're going to go towards the paid membership first. Now the paid membership, you can have the monthly or yearly subscription. That obviously depends on what you want to do. It's completely up to you. Um, but either way, they're both going to direct you into the paid community where you get weekly calls, live Q and A's, exclusive lessons, free resources, stuff which you wouldn't get in the free community, right? Now, the purpose of this paid community after that, it needs to go back into our funnel. So the way we're going to do that is then we've got an arrow which directs it back toward the acquisition section. And this is so that all the attention, all the results, anything which comes out of the paid community goes straight back into lead acquisition to kind of cycle it around and kind of use it as results. The paid community is also gonna be used to leverage the free community as well. So we can get people moving up from the free community up to the paid one as well, by you seeing the results and by seeing what they're missing out on, that FOMO kicks in and then they can move up the ladder. We also can have the paid community leveraging into a mentorship. And this can also go directly from the free sequences as well. So I'll explain how that happens. So if you're targeting someone, perhaps through emails or through a free community, you might want to take it that step further and offer a mentorship, which is perfectly fine. The way you do that, especially if you're starting out, you'd have your limited spots, obviously, that's important because you can't target 
50 people with a mentorship one-to-one. You'd promote them with exclusive scaling, one-to-one guidance, 24 access, millionaire, millionaire insights, guarantee in place, and then a qualification sequence. Now, the purpose of the qualification sequence is to make sure you don't get any time wasters. The purpose of the guarantee is to make sure that it makes the offer look a lot more appealing. And then there's also the 24-7 access, the one-to-one guidance. This is stuff which you're not going to get from the free Discord or you're not going to get from the paid Discord, or for example, because you're not going to have that sort of time allocation. So obviously, with a higher price range comes a higher ticket offer like a mentorship. And this is where this will kick in. And again, you'd utilize all these results again back into your whole funnel. Because you have to remember that every single step of the way, whatever results you get, you need to go back into your acquisition phase and to go back into your free community and nurture sequence in order to promote the other communities and the other sections to get people to move up. If you do want to set up a funnel like this for your paid community, there's a link in the description for you to book a call with me and we can have a quick 15 minute chat, absolutely free and zero obligation in order to kind of discuss a similar funnel for yourself or your business and where we can go with it. Now, if you do like this kind of content and want more business related content like this, then subscribe down below, like the video, and I will see you in the next one.